So what is technique? Is technique the grip of how you hold the mallets? Is technique the stroke that you use with your wrist and your elbow and your arms? Is technique your posture? Well, for me, technique is sound. Technique is my sound. I've always thought that if the music sounded great, well, then the technique must be great too, right? So when I'm working on my technique, I'm thinking about sound the whole time, okay? In combination with what I feel is gonna create the best sound, and that is how I define the technique. Okay, so if you have my book, Marimba, Technique Through Music, this book details all four of the basic strokes that are played with a four mallet grip, any four mallet grip. Now, this book offers exercises, it offers etudes. Each etude is focused on one primary stroke, allowing the student and the teacher to be able to focus on that particular stroke combined with musical phrasing and tone production. Okay, this video is going to review the four basic strokes and how we might practice them on the floor. And there's a very cool handout at the end. So stay to the end. You can get that link to be able to get the handout that you can use at home. Here we go. Okay, the four basic marimba strokes played on the floor. The first one is the single independent stroke. The single independent stroke is where one mallet performs, the other mallet stays relatively still. The performing mallet rotates around the axis of the unplayed mallet, always returning to the original playing height. Single independent strokes. Okay? The second one is the double vertical stroke. The double vertical stroke is where both mallets start at the up playing position, uh, play to the floor or to the bar, and then return. This shouldn't be a flam. Both mallets should play together. You can change the interval. You can play with both hands together. Separate. Okay, the next and the third uh, stroke, marimba stroke on the floor, is the double lateral stroke. Basically, one motion, two sounds, or three sounds. So that's either a double lateral or a triple lateral. The double lateral, all four mallets start in the up position at the same height. In this case, we're going the first one, we're going to start with one, two, three, four. So. Backwards to a four, three, two, one. Notice that I'm focusing on bringing my mallets back to the original height. No tension in my arms, no tension in my hands. The triple lateral, same premise, except you're playing three notes per hand. So a little quicker. Again, think one motion. Three sounds, always coming back to that same height. I'm playing the inside mallets first, play the outside. Faster. You can mix it up, start with the inside on the left, on the outside on the right, and reverse. Okay, and the final stroke, of the four basic strokes for the marimba is the single alternating stroke. Typically, this is where one mallet plays, recovers, then the next mallet plays. So at a slow tempo, it would look like this. At a slightly moderate tempo, these mallets will kind of look like a seesaw. And that's completely acceptable. Now, if that stroke starts to become quicker, a lot quicker, it, will, it could easily turn into a double lateral stroke. But at the moderate tempos, it's going to typically be the single alternating stroke. Imagine uh, Mitchell Peters' Yellow After the Rain solo in the middle section. He uses a lot of single alternating strokes. Imagine this section. 
There they are. Single alternating strokes. Always coming back to the same height. And there you have it. Those are the four basic marimba strokes that you use either with the Muster Stevens, the Burton grip, or the traditional grip. Those are all the same strokes regardless of grip. Okay, now it's up to you. Now I'm including in this video a page of exercises that one of my master's candidates at the University of North Texas, Robert Chapman, has put together. It's extraordinary. He's done an amazing job. He takes what I did in the marimba technique through music book and extends it much further. For those of you at home, these exercises could be a huge resource for you. Okay? Take it, work it, enjoy, be safe.